Hello friends, let's learn to study the cell from Geranium and Hydrilla leaf. Comments The cell of Hydra leaves are rectangular or brick shaped and compactly arranged in rows. The cell is bounded by a cell wall. The cell wall is filled with cytoplasm which encloses a nucleus and numerous round green pigment known as chloroplasts. The presence of chloroplasts spreading all over the cell is the characteristic feature of the green leaf and plant. Hydrilla plant is green due to presence of these pigments. Sometimes their number becomes so numerous that they mask the nucleus and make it invisible. Requirement A needle, a brush, a fleshy leaf of the hydrilla plants and geranium cell, iodine solution, glycerin, slides, a watch glass and a compound microscope. Observation Epidermal peel is frequented by stomata and epidermal hairs. The cell of the epidermis are extremely zigzag giving the appearance of zigzag puzzle. A pair of guard cells are in shape of half moon controlling the opening and closing of stomata. Each guard cell has nucleus, cytoplasm, and chloroplast. The adjacent cell of the stomata are similar to other epidermal cell. The epidermal cells contain nucleus, cytoplasm, but no chloroplast. No epidermal cells except the guard cells do possess the chloroplast. The epidermal hairs are pointed vertically, erect, and multicellular. So the conclusion thus above experiment can be performed under a compound microscope.